Shalom, Shalom. Call all you know your how Bahasham, your how Shai Bahasham, or Hakodash, double honest to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone who grew well. Shalom, Wachasad, Laha Bachayor. Peace and mercy to the elect. I'm your fellow servant, Damyadia. Represent the GMS Church here in Cleveland back in the spirit. I hope and I pray this is for our lesson. <clears throat> yeah, so uh, let me look this up because I just. The brother was informing me about a situation that happened in New Jersey, an earthquake, and how the apostles said he felt it, and they all the way. And then the brother said, "This, you know, if come on, bro, it says 4.4. The apostles, them, and then is I don't know how how long or far far away from they, that they are. You know, but that's a significant earthquake. If it's the the apostles felt it, you know, where they at from the from the epicenter of it." You know? But I'm going to look up the article and see exactly when it happened. Um, earthquake in New Jersey. Well, oh, April 1st, how, uh, today. Uh, so, April 5th. <clears throat> so yeah I'm trying to see an article on it here we go a 4.8 that's what they said a 4.8 you know rattled buildings across parts of the northeast on Friday morning so this morning called Lord like how about she I was shot see cause that's one of the things that the Lord the, the, the Lord said that Yahweh Shai, our Lord, our Lord, possess a pronoun, one zone, it's our Lord. He the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. We the descendants of Jacob. You see, that's our Lord. Not nobody. He ain't the Lord. He ain't the Lord of uh of the Edomites, man. You know? He's our Savior. Israel. Started with the elect of Israel. See, he our Savior, man. You know? And he told the, the, his disciples that became apostles that certain things was going to be happening on the earth because they asked him when he when he come back. See, the, the, they said, uh, 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 when, shall they, when, when shall these things be? And what shall be the sign of thy coming in the end of the world? Because it's, it's, in that word, world is uh, eon, which was which, which meaning a, a time period, you know, a period of time, I, you know? Yeah, I think it's, is it? Yeah, 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 cunt, cunt. Eon, right. An age. You see, so the age, when the age of the Edomites is going to be over. He told them certain things like this is going to be happening. Earthquakes in diverse places. See? So we pray the Lord said more earthquakes. Diverse mean various too. So Lord willing, the Lord starts sending more earthquakes through all, uh, through all, throughout America. More severe earthquakes. It was just an earthquake in... Uh, Taiwan too, and they allies to America. See, see, they serve the interests of of the beast. At the end of the day, I don't, I don't know if they Ammonites or fucking uh, Moabites over there. They probably Moabites though, cause China on them niggas. Man. Um, <clears throat> so, I mean, I'm, I could just get that priest. Up on here. Let me see. Um, I think it's a thing right like video too. Let me see. Let me see something. So this is uh Matthew chapter twenty four says signs of the end. It says, um, Matthew 24 and 1, Yahweh went out of out and departed for the temple. Let's talk about the, t the temple in Jerusalem, you know, which Solomon built. Like the um, apostle, I mean, the, the elder, um, Yahshua Wambar and the Akim is going into there. You know, um, it says, 
and his disciples came to him for to shew him the buildings of the temple. And Yahweh said unto them, See ye not all these things? Verily I say unto you, there shall not be left here one stone upon another that shall not be thrown down. And that's going into 70 AD, if I'm mistaken, from you know the siege of Jerusalem, 66 to 70 AD, when the Romans destroyed the, the temple, man. And the Romans are the Edomites, you devils. Because they, they know that's the connection between us and the Heavenly Father. See? You know? So they always try to separate us from our Lord, man. You know, because that's our power. That's our power source, the Heavenly Father, Yahweh, through His beloved Son, Yahweh Shah, man. See? So this is what our Lord Yahweh Shah was telling His disciples that what was going to be happening over there, you know? It says, And as He sat upon the Mount of Olives, the disciples came unto Him pri pri privately, saying, Tell us when shall these things be, and what shall be the sign of Thy coming and of the end of the world? Right. You know, because the Lord was telling them, certain things that was going to happen to him, this and that, you know, prophecies of the future, ruling us, you know, um, it says, and Yahweh answered, and we talking about the end of the world, he talked about the end of these Edomites, where it was particular prophecies that was supposed to happen, right, the beast was, uh, was wounded, with deadly wound was healed, that's talking about when Rome went down, which were the Edomites, the Western Roman Empire, the fall of that, the rise of the Holy Roman Empire, which was Jake. Um, <clears throat> you know, it, 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 then it had to come back according to the prophecy. You see? And then, this this is going to be the end. That's what the Lord going into. What's going to be happening. You know, with the, at the, and his second coming. It says, and Yahweh shall answer and said unto them, Take heed that no man deceive you, for many shall come in my name, saying I am a Mashiach, and shall deceive many. Come. It says, And ye shall hear of wars and rumors of wars. See that ye be not troubled, for all these things must come to pass, but the end is not yet. Yeah, yep. Because what? The prophecy of that our forefather of the of the the MOTB that prophecy has to be fulfilled before the nukes fly, you see. <clears throat> you know, before a full scale war breakout, World War, the War of Armageddon, pursuant to the scriptures, man. You know, the War of Armageddon, which Armageddon is a is a Hebrew word which means mountain of troops, man. Cause that's what the Lord gonna leave over there in his in his wake. We're gonna leave a lot of a mountain of troops. See, it says, uh, yeah, right. Uh, verse seven: For nation shall rise against nation, and kingdom against kingdom, and there shall be famines and pestilences, and earthquakes in diverse places. That's the point right there. I hope the video was I didn't hear, man, because that was loud as hell. I feel like I was talking. Mm. You know, so it's so a like it. It says, uh, it says, you're right, in earthquakes in diverse places. You see? So this is one of the, the indicators that the Lord is about to make his uh, second coming, man. You know, so this is a quick lesson. I pray this at the front. I give all glory on the praise of God. Lord, you may help. By Hashem, I will shout by Hashem. I will shout by Hashem. I will to the apostles and the elders, a great millstone. Rua, shalom, wa kasala, bakiyah, a flower ball.